What's up, people? Mr. Blackout back yet again. Uh, yeah, I can't help but do the uh, to the dark, eerie music. Yes, I thought, what better fitting tune than uh, that for this fugly looking map? Man, it, it, probably the fugliest looking map I've come across so far. I don't know, it reminds me of Carnival from Modern Warfare 2. Maybe that's just the whole theme park theme carrying on in my head. I don't know, I'm wired right now, I'm tired. I've, I've got coffee, Red Bull, tea all up in my system just to keep my mouth moving so I could do this commentary for you guys. It was an epic morning, night, whatever it was. It's all a blur at this point. <laughs> uh, we're playing some Domination on Zoo with a bunch of pros, actually. I'm going to run through the list of the players I'm playing with because they're all epic commentators. Uh, we got Aviator, Eric the Aviator, uh, T-Mart was in here, um, Ernest Lee, X-Jaws, Wings of Redemption, um, Onslaught was on for a little bit, uh, Mr. Nuckfuggets was here at some point, I don't know who's in this game right now, I I'm not going to bring the list up, but yeah, that was just a list of guys that I got to game with, which was quite an honor, I must admit, but uh, I'm going to give a little rundown of what I think about this map, and probably a little bit on the other maps too, I, I wanted to get the worst one out of the way first, really, That's that was my whole point in bringing out the zoo, plus it, I got a semi-decent gameplay for having it for the first night, you know. As we all know, campers and ghost players are in abundance at times like this. And look at that major fail right there. <laughs> uh, the guy like disappeared out of my view and I did an automatic involuntary drop shot. I can't help it sometimes, man. It's just like, it's like an instinct, you know? Now one thing I have noticed about this map, guys, is it seems to be really facilitating medium to long range weaponry. Now I know you could probably do some work on here with the shotguns and the SMGs, and I will definitely get around to trying it out at some point. But for now, I would definitely recommend using an assault rifle just until you get used to the maps, uh, get used to the pathways and the outflanking maneuvers that you can get behind people. And can you see this guy on the Blackbird right here? Now I thought he was upstairs. Come to find Enemy out, he's right coming. behind me, or to my left. <laughs> he was totally AFK. This is what happens at 6 o'clock in the morning and people are passing out on their controllers. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I would definitely recommend Enemy using assault secure. rifles. Like I said, at least until you get to grips with it all and you work out the pathways the majority of people are taking. There's quite a few uh, sniping spots on this map. Uh, you'll see right at the end of this video one of them. <laughs> oh yeah, you'll see it alright. Now, I'm really excited about the theater mode on uh, all these new map packs. You know me and my theatre mode stuff, I really like to get down and dirty with it. And who knows what's going to happen with all these new environments I've got to work with now. Um, I'm going to be working on one here in the next couple of days. I'm going to get some decent gameplay, get some kill streaks together so I can uh, get some mini movies out and about. I know you guys look forward to those videos. And for some reason my mic keeps cutting out and crackling away guys, so I'm going to have to go out and buy a new microphone here this afternoon. That's on the agenda now if I don't... Uh, pass out in the next 30 minutes. <laughs> anyway, like I said, Theatre Mode's going to be here very shortly, and if you guys have any music suggestions, please send it my way. I'm always on the search for good music, and preferably non-copywritten music, and I'm about to fail here on this Claymore. Boom. I thought it had like a, you know, like a 80 degree blast radius so I could squeeze up against the wall and get away with it, but apparently it has a 180 degree blast radius, and I didn't get away with it. So anyway, my consensus on this whole map pack, other than the fact that Zoo is very fugly, um, I, I like it be a lot better than the first one. Uh, I know a lot of people didn't like the first one a lot, and I'm sure there's going to be many of you that hate this one too, but me, I, I'm actually alright with it. I like it. Apart from, like I said, Zoo is probably my most hated map so far. Stockpile is my favorite map. Now, I will be doing a gameplay on Stockpile very shortly. Uh, because stockpile is, it's, man, it's, it's hectic. It's, it's going to be a really fun map, I know. Um, and I'm going to talk more about that on that gameplay. I could probably really go ranting about how awesome that map is right now, but we're on Zoo, so I'm going to, I'm going to try to stay here as best I can. Learning this map and the other new maps is going to be a test of patience for the next week or so, you know? There's going to be a lot of things that we've got to get used to. Sniping spots, camping spots. As you can see, there's a lot of long ranges, you know, uh, snipers are going to be in abundance on this map too. It's hard to see people just because of the dullness of the map. So uh, it's going to be a testy time, guys. So you got to be patient. Um, I recommend using Domination as the game type to learn maps. Just because 
it's easier to predict where the enemy's coming from. It's not as frustrating as, uh, for instance, Team Deathmatch, where the spawns flip on a regular basis. Uh, this is a lot easier to predict. You can see on the red dot, um, the red dots on the UAV. I'm about to lay an ambush up right here. Let, let's ambush the enemy team as they think they're flanking us. <laughs> ambush! Sit down, as only use my blade would say. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, so just be patient, guys. I know it's going to be a week or so before everyone gets used to it. The community itself is probably going to end up turning these maps into their game ways. I don't know how to explain it, you know. Once you once the community's played a map for so long, it turns into kind of a, a norm, normal thing. Like, you know how the map's going to go. Everyone has their own strategy. All that type of stuff's going to happen here after a week or so. So we'll see how it all ends up. I don't know. I'm going to do some work up on this rock right here. This, uh, this, this rock's a nice little sniping spot, I suppose, but there's a, a, on the other end of the map, there's almost an identical kind of elevated spot for snipers on the other end, you know? And you'll see right at the end that <laughs> that's what happens to me. <laughs> oh, well. Anyways, I know that there isn't that much long left on this commentary. There's a couple things I wanted to uh, let you guys know that are going to be happening on my channel here pretty soon. Uh, number one, first of all, I'm going to start this thing on Mondays. I'm probably going to experiment it this coming Monday. I'm going to do live commentary. My first ever live commentary. Um, it's going to be a Monday thing if it goes well. So I'd like it if you guys come and check it out. And if you enjoy the live com, by all means, let me know and I will uh, do it on a regular basis. Uh, the other thing is, is I've got a feature Friday coming up this, this Friday, which is uh, three days from now or so. Uh, got a really good fri feature Friday coming up. You have to go check out the guy's channel. And if you guys have any other series, 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 series. <laughs> How do you say that word? Is it just series? All right, any series that you'd like to see on my channel, by all means, leave a suggestion, and I will. I'm always willing to try new things out. And um, I want to stick to a schedule so you guys know what's coming and when it's coming. And uh, get stunned. Yes. And uh, this is this is the wrapping it up here, guys. Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> this is the sniper on the other end. Follow me on Twitter if you yeah, guys ever want to play with me. I'm always trying to get a game up. And uh, have a good one. I love you long time. Peace from Mr. Blackout. Who let the dogs out? 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 When the party was nice, the party was pumping. And everybody having a ball. Until the fellas start the name calling.